covered both educational and also uh, aesthetic or recreational, we can call it. So for a teacher, how I see the Erasmus program, it has its recreation part, which can be helpful for refreshing maybe the teacher during the school year or even during the summer for a week or two in some programs. But also the educational part was uh, obvious. So what did we do? First day arrival time. It was very nice. Of course, I needed to find a place. It wasn't very hard. This is the place. Um, it's also a school. So they had this school. And this part only was for training. So this whole building was for training students and teachers. So they gave us some flyers, what we can see in the city. And of course, the capital, Valletta, uh, Medina. These are the main cities to discover. So the card, uh, the second day, so the first day we, they took our pictures and everything, and the second day already they gave us this card. That was my group, that's our trainer, Mario Cordina. Uh, with me, most of them were Polish, German, that's it, Polish and German. He was Maltese, he was Maltese, but he knew Polish because he lived long years in Poland. A nice idea, which we do in the school, I liked it, so other teachers didn't do that, their school didn't do. We give every student a personalized email. Uh, so he gave the importance, he said very important that to have the personalized email only for the school so the student can differentiate his life, which is a school life, and his other life, which is his personal life. So that's a nice thing, we already do it. And a lot of uh, models, a lot of talking went on. Uh, the SAMR uh, plan or the model which deals with technology. It was done very early on. I won't talk all about it because he was just talking about these, like how it came through. So the simplest technology which started in education, already we had this model. So if the technology we're using, if it doesn't follow all these, so then it's almost useless to use it. So sometimes, using the paper would be the same using as the technology. Like we didn't do any advantage, anything extra about it. Then we need to rethink. Uh, although he was focusing on technology, but he, he still said like he sees nothing wrong in using papers, uh, old fashioned, because it still has its good signs. But many times the technology has its huge advantage over the old school. So another thing related to that is a scaffolding, which is very famous. Like we give only small parts as if a scaffold, and they build the building. Okay, so the scaffold is just put by us. So we don't just give them every information, everything. Let them do the work. These two were very uh, nice thoughts for the teaching. Uh, that's interactive whiteboards. This is explaining about the wikis there. I will just cut it short for time. And that's the certificate. So the last day we had to be there, of course, to give everybody his own uh, certificate. And I will open some city photos soon.